Alright, again, I don't know how long this video will last, but this goes out to the reason why I post a lot of stuff on um, Facebook, YouTube, TikTok, and all that. Um, it's, it's, it's debris awareness and stuff and all that, and they call fucking shit out. Um, especially my opinion about how, like, I mean, put stuff on there on Facebook and, and YouTube and bring my my thoughts and opinions on it to have a conversation about it. Because, like, men have no problem calling out other men for their shit. Because you're making men look bad. All right? Women, you have a problem with doing that. You have a problem with holding your gender accountable. <laughs> and then you want to get mad when men do it. But it's like, you guys can either do it softly, or we can do it the men way. You know, it's like, we can do it this easy way or the hard way. I don't understand when that, that thought process got lost. And... Fucking around, find now accountability. Uh, sh I think I bring shaming and bullying back. Um, bullying for you know men and shaming for women to keep us in line. Um, but yeah, that's one of my biggest issues because like you know I mean that's one of the reasons why I bring a lot of awareness for a lot of these issues. I mean I bash men and I have a problem with a lot of shit men are doing. All right, but um, <clears throat> like I, I, I women are just out of control. Um, acting like they're intelligent, intellectual, logical, sound, open-minded, emotional intelligence, empathetic. <clears throat> and they're not, especially modern-day women. They are so not. Um, they definitely will use the fucking the four fucking rules, fucking insult, guilt, shame, and they need to be right because that is all women. Some are better than others, but no. And that's one of the main reasons why I bring a lot of these videos out there, um, especially on Facebook, um, and express my opinion, especially about how, like, women just have been allowed to express their opinion for too long. And <clears throat> if women want to actually start, like, checking women, um, <clears throat> stop making excuses, stop making, you know, you know, allowing them to have no accountability. The female echo chamber of sisterhood bullshit um, needs to stop. Um, you guys need to start holding each other accountable. Uh, and get the fuck off men's back. Because I'm sorry, majority of men out there are good men. Majority of men out there want to get married. Majority of men want to be fathers, want to be a, have a wife, want to support them and you know pay for them and you know protect them and provide for them. All right, Majority of men out there want that want to give their wife that Cinderella wedding. They want to treat you like a princess. But unfortunately, women think that comes with the fantasy outlook on it, which is technically the female lens, and men live in reality and see things through the male lens, which is I hate to break it to you ladies out there, but men are more right. Men understand the world and how life works. Men understand pain. Men understand tr dealing with trauma. Going through trauma and dealing with it. Overcoming it actually doing healing all right um women don't i guess one of the reasons why i do feel like fucking women do not need to experience life because they they don't they're not built from it they don't get they don't bit they're not their, their character is not built and formed in the fires of trauma and pain all right enjoy women um they get broken they get damaged they get jaded they get uh, they cope and then they make excuses and blame men. I mean, it's definitely everybody's fault but theirs. Um, <laughs> and this whole thing about, like, uh, not all, not all. You know, the, the exception does not, you know, make the rule. All right. <laughs> Shoulda, woulda, coulda went out the window, and this is what it is. <laughs> and, <laughs> I mean, it would be nice, I mean, for a beautiful utopia world where women, men and women can build together and, you know, conquer the, the world together, you know, like, hey, whatever. But that's not how reality works. That's not how life is. All right. That is stuck in Lulu land of the, you know, fairy tale. <clears throat> Sounds good on paper, but it's not going to work. Um, and yeah, I don't know what else to say besides that. 